Agile Coach Learning Path by Agile Mania. In this video of Agile Coach Learning Path, we will introduce you with the following topics. Introduction. History of Agile. Values. Agile Software Development. The Four Phases of Agile Mania's Agile Coach Learning Path. If you like the video, we request you to like and subscribe to the Agile Mania YouTube channel to encourage us to provide more valuable information on Agile and Scrum. Agile Mania is a team of passionate professionals with years of experience focused on consulting organizations in transforming businesses with digital and Agile. We play a key role in accelerating your digitization journey and help you navigate to a highly functioning Agile culture. Our Agile Coach Learning Path is based on the IC Agile Learning Roadmap. The IC Agile program from Agile Mania is created to help organizations attain business agility. Before we dive into the program, let's talk about the history of Agile. Many people know what Agile is, but very few know about the history of Agile. Agile came into existence after the Agile Manifesto was published in 2001. The values highlighted in the Agile Manifesto laid the foundation for Agile software development. So, and, what are those values? First, individuals and interactions precede over tools and processes. That is to say, competent people need to work together, and there needs to be seamless communication between them. Second, working software over comprehensive documentation. While good documentation helps people understand how the software is built, the main focus should be building the software. Third, customer collaboration over contract negotiation. A contract should be in place but shouldn't be prioritized over work based on customer needs. Fourth, respond to change by following a plan. A project plan is the standard way to go, but it should be flexible enough to accommodate changes as per stakeholders' requirements and customer pain points and solutions. The Agile way of working is not the same as Agile software development. There is a paradigm shift in doing business, organization structure, policies, and operational activities when we talk about Agile ways of working. So, that was the brief history of Agile. Now, let's dive into the main topic that you're eagerly waiting for, that is, the four phases of Agile Amania's Agile Coach Learning Path. The first phase. Second phase. Third phase. Fourth and final phase. We will discuss each phase in brief to have a clear understanding of the learnings each phase has to provide you with. The first phase is to learn the basics of Agile mindsets and tips and tricks to facilitate Agile ways of working. In the Agile facilitation phase, there are two training certifications. The first certification is Agile Fundamentals Bootcamp, an Agile Basics workshop covering the Agile mindset, values, principles, and elementary concepts to start the Agile transformation. The second certification is the Agile Team Facilitation Certification. It focuses on the mindset and role of an Agile team facilitator and the provision of group facilitation tools and techniques. The second phase is Agile Team Coaching to learn coaching conversation and business agility to connect leaders outside the team. One is Agile Team Coaching, where attendees will learn foundational team coaching and team development concepts. It will help you build and grow your team. The other certification is Business Agility Foundation. It will help you delight customers and bring innovation and constant improvement to your work and organization. You will be able to build a strong organization through team dynamics, adaptive planning, value-based development, and iterative feedback cycles. The third phase is Enterprise Agile Coaching to learn how to introduce agility in an organization and support change. In the Enterprise Coaching phase, there are two certifications. The first one is Agility in the Enterprise, where participants will gain a concrete understanding of agility at the enterprise level. This certification will teach you how firms become highly responsive and more purpose-driven. The second certification is Coaching Agile Transition. The workshop will help attendees learn prime elements of an agile transformation, key enterprise coaching competencies, organizational and human change processes, and transformational strategies. Fourth and final phase. The fourth and final phase is business agility coaching to expand your coaching tools to help people working in different functions. In the business agility phase, there are two certifications. One is leading with agility, where attendees will learn the need for business agility and personal key competencies to lead the agile transformation. 
they will also learn about the organizational elements required to emerge victorious in today's cutthroat competitive business environment. By taking this course, participants will be able to develop leadership skills. It focuses on transformational behavior and skills to increase business agility. The following certification is Agility in Human Resources. This certification is for business leaders, personnel developers, recruiters who work closely with the HR department in organizations. They will learn about agile mindset, organizational design, roles, career paths, performance, goals and motivation, promotions, talent acquisition, retention, and learning and development. And that brings us to the end of the Agile Coaching Learning Path. We have the Learning Cohort Program for all these four steps, but don't worry, that's a topic for another day. We hope you liked the learning path. See you soon with some more learning paths.